Hello and welcome back to Oxygen Not Included. Uh, so you join me, um, just as I've been setting the dupes, a little bit of busy work. Pretty much um, just cleared out a little bit more of this area, opened this up to let the oxalite uh, improve the oxygen levels and just set some of the storage compactors uh, to be active. Uh, this area is nasty. It is not very nice down here. I need to do something about that. Yeah, that's going to be a problem. They don't come down here very often apart from for the um, compost. So it's not super critical. But <laughs> that's not great. That's not great by any means. It's fairly contained in this area right now, so... Okay, this should be good. I mean, yeah, all, all up here is okay. They're, they're sweeping, tidying. Let's have a look at decor. Is that going to be F... F8? Could do with some more decor up here. We've got this set to uh, to be done. Um, and there's nothing nothing down here. I don't know what I'm going to use this area for, to be fair. But I've got to do something about the oxygen down here. Okay, we have these plants, and what I thought I'd do here is I would set this storage bin to be fertilizer. It's near the plants. Uh, we found the cold zone up here. Um, so we're going to be putting food storage up here somewhere, or at least retrieving a wheeze wart um, and uh, getting that to grow exactly where we'd like it to be. Right, what have we got new? Not a great deal. Right, for some reason they're sweeping but not digging. It's probably on a lower priority. I need to sweep that. I need to sweep that. Okay, yeah, we don't really want them coming down here very often, but um, what is it the, uh, is it the air scrubber? That actually, um, I probably uh, clicked past it because I've only been looking at the um, active items. Let's just have a quick look, sorry about that. Gas pipe, gas filters, food, not being food, would it? It's got to be the oxygen. Oh, air scrubber. Filters carbon dioxide and removes it from the air. It needs water and it needs some power as well. It needs a liquid intake pipe. So air scrubber is something we want to research fairly, uh, fairly soon. Um, Oh, there it is, sanitation. Uh, let's do sanitation next then. Oh, we've got some food over here. Some goodies. Yeah, they're not happy down in this area, but to be honest, um, because they're not going down there very often, it's not really a great issue. Um, and I've got these tiles in. In fact, I might put a couple more just to make sure the, um, the area stays nice and uh, safe. Actually, let's cancel.
keep it all in line. Keep the colour near nice, even state. <laughs> I can't help myself. It's a bit of a problem. Go across there next. They do like building things before digging. I wonder what priority I've got all this digging. No, the priority is the same. They just need to uh, choose to do it, don't they? Oh, we've got something to be swept here. Thank you. Bit of coal. Right, they've got the food being swept. That's very good to see. So we are getting some food. Uh, stress is non-existent. We've opened this area up. I bet we get that swept um, and we'll continue this tile across here. What have we got down here? We've got a bit of polluted water which we can use for irrigating some of the... Um, I think the meal would need polluted water, I think. And we may as well get them digging to sort of around there. I don't want to go too much further. I don't want to get involved in this water. Went too far. Got a puffed over here. Got a couple of puffs. They're so funny. And there's a lovely heart-shaped geyser. There's our geyser. Oh, that's lovely. Let's get rid of that and we'll grab a little screenshot of the uh, lovely geyser. Need to do something about this hatch. He's eating our food. We're not desperate. It's, it's not a great, great issue at the moment, but... Right, what have, we, what have we got to sweep? I don't want to lose any of these uh, food items. How are we doing for those? They're okay. Nice, we've still got this little bit of oxalite. Uh, I need to dig the sand out here. Now I've started all of this up here, that's good to see. I can grab that. So much sweeping. It's a pretty, um, pretty decent map actually. I've been quite conservative with my oxygen generation. I'm restricting it purely to the areas that they're visiting, and that seems to be play paying off at the moment. Um, We'll have to open this up and get this hatch out of here soon. We should get some um, some of these tiles in now. How, how is everything doing? This 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 is looking pretty decent. Um, can't complain there really. We should probably dig there. And we should probably dig all of that out too. And probably make this area a little bit um, larger for the, uh, the carbon dioxide. These plants are going to suffer soon down here anyway. So I could probably dig those up pretty... Uh, pretty soon. I haven't dug any of this out yet. We're going to need some more storage compactors. But that's no problem, we can get those built. That should be enough for now. Let's get these uh, little lumps of sand out their way. 
make sure that they still sweep the algae. Algae? Is it algae or algae? Never quite sure. Oh, right, yeah, that's fine. That's scheduled to be swept. I think we're doing okay, guys. Um, our galactic friends seem pretty happy. Let's copy the settings of these over to these other compactors. I think this um, facility, this ability at least, is um, fantastic. If you finish this compactor, please. Pretty, please. Well, they'll get to it, won't they? Okay, let's get some more decor. Because that makes everyone happy. Um. Might as well, may as well make one of those there. And these, uh, this area is awful, but I'm really not sure what I'm going to use that for yet, so. Let's make a, a couple more cots, maybe. We've got this area in there. Might as well make it look pretty. Plenty for them to be uh, getting on with there. I'm not sure about the stress, um, the changes in stress now. I quite liked managing that before. Uh, I know that doesn't seem to be much of an issue at all. Now, what's happened here? Out of order requires emptying. Oh, they're cleaning. That's okay then. Good. <laughs> right, research. What have we got? So we've got sanitation level one. Let's do fine dining level one. Made a mess. Who made a mess? I probably need another toilet. Oh, good God. Yeah, I'm going to need another toilet somewhere else. Uh, where should we put the other toilet? I'll tell you where we'll put the other toilet. Put it down here by the out, by the compost heap. That's probably not a good idea, actually. That oxygen level is not great, is it? How about we put the toilet here? Right under the other one. And then they don't have to um, travel too far. Right, let's keep an eye. Have we got anything else going wrong? <laughs> we need to get our food refrigerated, but as we really haven't done an awful lot um, about um, improving our food yet, I'm not too worried. Wow, that went very laggy then. Fertiliser. We need that swept, please. Organic polluted dirt. Ah, right, okay. The fertiliser is up by the plants, isn't it? How much have we got? 210. Whew. Okay. I need to get something to clean the air there, definitely. <laughs> oh, I love how happy she gets. Oh wow, she's had to go down there to get oxygen. That's a bad state of affairs, isn't it? Hold your breath. Nice. Yeah, get back up there and get some air. It's pretty good up there, actually.
We need to do something about this room. I might. Is this open? This is polluted oxygen. I'm wondering whether I ought to dig a shaft down here and let this all drop down that way. But then I'm releasing this, aren't I? Oh dear. What to do? What to do? They're not having to go down here very much and once this is built I'll be happier. Let's put a few of these um, gas permeable tiles in. Let's put one there. Uh, let's put one every two uh, where they sleep. Keep that airflow moving. Probably one under the toilet. Okay, we need to sweep the food up. I don't like that sitting on the floor. No big, great disasters yet. It's quite encouraging. <laughs> just noticed this one isn't set. I've got plenty of storage now anyway. Okay. They're not using water really very much at all considering it's the agriculture upgrade but then I'm not really doing any farming yet so... Research. Let's check on research. Right, we've done fine dining. Uh, the first level at least. I'm going to do them all first level and then drop in the uh, the second. Uh, let's do filtration next. I really ought to open this up. Um, I'm wondering about maybe making this larger. But they're really not using this at all. Oh, actually this oxygen, this oxygen is kind of getting around now. Oh, that's a bit worrying when they have to do that to get better air. Nearly done, Selena. Nearly done. Um, this is just there's a vacuum up here, I think. Yeah, it's not like there's um, polluted air or, or anything up there. I think this has been quite a revelation for me. Um, only put in two algae deoxidizers in place. Um, usually I spam them all over the map and run out of algae quite quickly and this time round I've, I've not done that and it's um, I'm into what cycle 16. Uh, oxygen's fine and um, yes yeah, it's, it's a different way of playing the game for me. Definitely. Let's harvest the food up here. Now, how much seed do we have? We have 23 briar, uh, uh, mealwood seeds. One blossom seed. So this is what I'm concerned about now. We've got to get the farming working. Um, whoops and make sure that we don't lose access to these uh, these seeds because there's going to come a point when they're actually out of um, out of harvest range and they'll disappear uh, but we've still got you know we've still got access to some of this uh, I haven't touched any of that yet 
Keep getting them to swing. And dig. So, yeah, this is going okay. Um, I was a little bit worried. I really didn't know anything about the agricultural side of the uh, of the game. And uh, I just read a few things uh, about the plants, about their preferences and the fact that you've got to keep on top of the um, harvesting the seeds, make sure that you don't run out because um, then you've got to go out into the world and find another one. But this is going to be really interesting. Um, that's pretty hard to get to with all this water. But uh, I need to get this sorted for the food storage. I think we'll make this the mess area. Temperature wise, that, yeah, that area is pretty cold. I could put the supercomputer up here once I've done all the first level research and I can disable that so how are we doing we've done filtration temperature modulation next let's get them all done to the first level and see how it goes I'm being really careful with copper as well this time um, I've got plenty agricultural wise fertilizer is not great How's this down here? If I open this up a little bit, that would probably help with the airflow a little bit more. Maybe put one of these gas permeable tiles in. Just to help move that down. What I'll probably do is maybe need to keep an eye because that's sand that's fertilizer so this really isn't very uh, strong let's do that to seal that off and just reinforce this um, if it floods it's only going to go down here and I can just open this door Um, what are they going to do next? There's no telling what they're going to do next. We've got stuff up there. Oh, they've started working over here. That's good. Started working there. Plenty of copper. We're doing okay for all that. Would be nice if they would do this next. So let's prioritise this to six. I wonder if it's possible to make that seven, really to give that some real strength. Can they reach that? They need that dug out, don't they? Okay, let's make that a priority. Come on. That's a weak spot, guys. <laughs> Come on. Let's put that as eight. I don't like that being there. I mean, it's got two blocks. Um, and we could certainly break down and get that to flow in and maybe make this bigger. It's definitely something we could do. I can hear all sorts of things over here. that polluted water there which we can pump in for irrigation plenty of this sleet wheat one harvest remaining standard yield harvest is ready okay uh, yes they finished that that's good
pretty uneventful episode really um right we've got 2020 let's do pressure management and then we've only got combustion and these three and we can deconstruct we can deconstruct that and um, put the supercomputer over here in the cooler area with a similar setup to this um, And that'll be a pretty good way of doing it, I think. Pretty safe. I've tried to play a little bit faster speed to get more things done more quickly. And I think that's paying off. Um, food's dropping a little bit. We could probably... Probably turn our attention to that next. Okay, we've got Hobo doing more research. How are you doing, Hobo? Nearly done. Keep an eye on that more closely. No sign of this breaking, so that's good. Oh, they're starting work here. Oh, oh, sopping wet. Sorry, Selena. Not very pleasant. Stress. It just hasn't been an issue at, at all. I mean, in any way, shape, or form. It's quite incredible. I really enjoyed looking after the stress in the old game. So maybe they'll balance that out a little bit more. And it's um, interesting. Food is, yeah, food is um, a bit of a concern right now. Oh dear. Oh, they're, they're getting a little bit stressed. Why are they getting stressed? Selena is stressed. Okay. Well, this is going to kick in. Maximum stress they're allowed to get to is 10. Hopefully we'll get a harvest down here we can um, reach. And very soon we're going to be able to harvest these um, when we break into this area. We've got some more polluted water up here and there's plenty more sleep wheat in that area there, which we can go and hit up. I wonder how 39%, these are really not uh, growing very well at all, are they? Maybe I should put another planter box in. Ah, we've got some more food there. Right, let's make this a priority seven to sweep these actually. Make sure we keep on top of that. We've got these down here if they can reach them. Sorry Selena. Just watching them work is quite exhausting. <laughs> oh dear. I'm really going for it. There's a little bit more food they've discovered there. Uh oh. Come back. Come back. Get him, get him. <laughs> ah! Right, they've got some food there now. I think there are a lot more hatches in this um, update because of combat, uh, because they need it for food, which is fairly interesting. Let's get them to dig that out because it's stopping them from moving for forward with that. Uh, no sign of this cracking, that's good. See, food is back up again now, just from these few things that we found. Ah, and we've got a harvest. Nice. 
Now that's asking for a plant and they've planted it. Now that's what I've got to stop them from doing. We've got enough, I think. Let's look at seeds. Actually, look how many seeds we've got there. Unrefrigerated food. Yeah, I've got to get that sorted next. We'll do this later. They'll be they'll be to uh, to that area soon. There's not actually a lot of digging left to do. Oh, oxygen. That's helped, I think, having this um, this here. I could probably open it up um, a tiny bit. I could probably um, come down into this in the same way I have here um, and, and that will give me a little bit of storage of uh, the carbon over there too. Okay, I'm pretty happy with that. Um, we've got an awful lot done today. Um, I think we're in a good spot. Our research, let's just have a look. Did we finish? So we've finished that one, that one, that one, that one, that one, that one. And this one is next. Um, we've only got three left, but they're level 40. Yeah, that's interesting, isn't it? That's a different way of playing the game, just doing one set of research, I think. And then when I build the supercomputer in this area, um, yeah, then we'll have um, we will have plenty of cold air. Now I've made this three high, and really it should be four. Yeah. So one, two, three, four, and then a roof. Oops. Right, let's cancel. Oh well, it doesn't matter because we're going to have to harvest that sort of thing anyway. There we go. Uh, we are going to have to be careful around here, so let's cancel these couple. Um, I really want to be aware of when they get to this point, so but at least that's all in place now. Um, we can sweep that too. Two harvests remaining. Is it worth me cancelling that one tile? I have to go up there and retrieve that before we um, we uh, move on any further. Still got plenty of these. I could put some more in, but they're they're all empty. Skill increase. Good, good. Not much sweeping left to do. We've still got this food under here too. fella. Need to let him out. Oh, what's that? A pincher peppernut. Or pinker peppernut. Nice. All sorts of strange foods. These guys are much happier. There's plenty of polluted oxygen for them to, uh, to eat there. <laughs> it's really cool. Very pretty. I really like this game a lot. Look at their little faces. Oh, they're both breathing in now. One of you breathe out. There we go. Good, okay. Should have at least good one good shot of, uh, of those fellas. Um, what are they doing now? What have we got? We've still got some digging. 
Oxygen is cracking on with these. I mean, they're, it's not an issue at all. Okay, I'm going to leave it there then. Um, pretty happy with that. We've really expanded the base. Uh, our oxygen's doing fine. Food's not great. I need to really seriously look at food next. But I think um, giving myself room... Um, getting a lot of this cleared out um, I've got access to water uh, and polluted water for irrigation um, we've got an awful lot of work done we've got the geyser down there we've got these guys pooping out plenty of coal uh, slime uh, we've got access soon to the wheeze wart so we've done an awful lot of research um, Actually, we are done every level. I may as well get them kicking on that next. Um, and then I'll deconstruct the this setup here. I'll leave the battery and the wheel in place for the massage table and the oxy deoxidizers. Uh, but we'll set up the supercomputer up here along with some food storage. Uh, another wheel and uh, perhaps a big battery or a small battery um, and get that done over here um, yeah that's it's not bad it's going quite well I think um, I don't know what's above us but we've got interesting foods to discover uh, just need to really get a handle on how to treat them and we've got water here so if we if we explore here carefully before we break through the uh, the geyser once we break through we'll have unlimited water down in this area so water's going to be fine so it's a it's a pretty interesting map how are we doing for algae? Yeah, algae's okay. We've got more we can dig out, uh, and we will dig out, so... That's um, not going to be uh, a problem. We've got all of this here. We can expand to the left. Uh, we've got all of this here if we, uh, if we need it. Um, and then we've got slime over here, so we're in a really good position, I think. Um, I don't know how far they can move over there. Let's just make sure we don't lose any of these um, food items that they're dropping around all over the place. How did a hatch get there? Attack. Please, combat. Well, here's a bit of late, uh, late drama. <laughs> there you go, guys. Have some food for your troubles. I don't know how, where he came from. He must have come out of one of these buried items somewhere. I'm hoping they can get in and back out of these areas, okay. And we've got a hatch in here as well, somewhere, I think. Unless he's dead. Yeah, no, there he is. Yeah, okay. So, um, I'm going to leave the episode here. I know I've already said that, sorry. Um, leave the episode here and uh, join me again next time and we'll see what other adventures uh, our dupes can get up to. So, thanks for watching. Bye for now.